Happy 50th in the world of sneakers and athletic wear, you don't get any bigger than Nike. Arguably, no other brand has made a bigger impact. Now, while everyone knows the swoosh logo, there are plenty of things that will surprise you about the footwear giant. So let's just do it and learn more about Nike. To celebrate the golden anniversary of Nike, we've rounded up five fun facts about the footwear giant. And it starts with the iconic swoosh logo. Co-founder Phil Knight wanted it to represent speed. It was created by Carolyn Davidson when she was a design student at Portland State University. She was only paid $35 for her work. I paid her $2 an hour, and uh, I never thought she'd spend 17 and a half hours on the project. <laughs> But as the Oregonian reported back in 1983, she was gifted more than $600,000 worth of stock. Wow. Up next, sneaker culture got its unofficial start in 1985 with the launch of Nike's Air Jordan 1. Made famous by basketball player Michael Jordan, Nike now makes more than $5 billion a year off the brand. Emmy award-winning commercials are the next step in our anniversary celebration, and each one tells a story. The year 2000's The Morning After played on our fears of Y2K. It's just one of four Emmy award-winning TV spots the brand has won. We're never alone, and that is our strength. The latest, You Can't Stop Us, features unique split-screen editing and an uplifting message of unity through athletics. And no matter how bad it gets, we will always come back stronger. At number four, Nike helped make movie magic in Back to the Future 2. Known as the Nike Mags, the auto lace shoes were released in 2011 and 2016 in very limited quantities, and YouTube channel Sneaker News got to try them out. We'll tie a bow on our Nike anniversary with a Spike Lee tribute mini movie. You know, you know, you know, I've seen it all before. The legendary director of classics like Do the Right Thing and He Got Game reprises his Mars Blackman character from 1989's She's Gotta Have It. I was in it, I was in it, I was in it. We're celebrating 50 years.